That 19 year old suspect was arraigned in a New Haven court earlier today. Now this afternoon in a rare event, the Metro Transit Authority police uh, updated reporters on the investigation. This was not a random attack. Uh, the victim and gunman, along with the second suspect, were involved in a dispute right before the incident and were believed uh, the victim was the sole intended target. No other riders were involved. Metro Transit Authority police arresting 19 year old Dayron Sanchez of Derby for the July 5th shooting at New Haven's Union Station. That incident shut down the Metro North New Haven line for hours as police investigated. Sanchez, who is charged in the shooting, was arraigned Thursday on multiple charges. Investigators say the images released to news outlets played a role in identifying the suspect. According to an arrest warrant, the suspect's mom, as well as a neighbor, notified police saying they recognized one of the men in the pictures. Police also sharing this picture of a gun they say was found in Sanchez's bedroom. MTA detectives then obtained a warrant to search the house and later found the gun matching the caliber of the firearm used for the shooting. Police say they believe they know who the second suspect is and are keeping a close eye on him. The search for the second suspect is ongoing, but we do believe that uh, Sanchez is the one who fired the gun. The warrant also revealing the second suspect involved attempted to stab the victim who was taken to the hospital to be treated, who has since been released. It's real important that these officers that were working here went out there and uh, started first aid on the victim. That is extremely important or we'd be talking about a homicide here. New Haven Mayor Justin Elliker reassuring the public that this was a targeted incident and that Union Station is a safe place. It is very important for people to, under, to understand that Union Station is a safe place to come. Uh, thousands of people come here every day uh, and this situation, while deeply unfortunate, uh, was one that is very, very, very unusual. Sanchez is charged with assault and criminal possession of a firearm. Uh, he is expected to be back in court on August 2nd. He's being held on a $500,000 bond. As far as that second suspect, police say if you've seen him recently or recognize him, to call them immediately. Live in New Haven, Jake Garcia, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.